அருட்பெரும் ஜோதி அருட்பெரும் ஜோதி தனிப்பெரும் கருணை அருட்பெரும் ஜோதி அருட்பெரும் ஜோதியாகவல் எக்ஸ்பிளேஷன் பை சுவாமி சரவணானந்தா அப் திண்டுக்கல் இன் இங்கிலீஷ் ஹெட்டிங் ஃபிஃப்டி செவன் இன்டிவிசிபிள் நாலெட்ஜ் ஆஃப் நாலெட்ஜ் பிரிவு சரியா பெரும்பொருளா என் அறிவு கரிவம் அருட்பெருஞ்சோதி இன் தி ஃபோர் கான் ஃபோர் கான் லைன்ஸ் வி வர் டோல் தேட் தி மேன் அண்ட் தி காட் ரிட்டர்னலி இன் ஒன் ஃபார்ம் அண்ட் தேர் வாஸ் நோ செப்பரேஷன் பிட்வீன் தெம் அட் எனி டைம் அண்ட் பிளேஸ் Eternally living in the soul atom, the Almighty is by some form or other for its final divine enlightenment. At least in this bodily life, we have come to know that we have been living in the non-dualistic form of God. It is the truth that God and soul non-separable existing is in one form, was continuously receiving all sorts of life's experiences through all different bodies in this developed human life we have understood our inner divine soul and the inner divine soul the body are not of same nature but completely of different nature this inner divine is unseen and changeless on the other hand the outer bodily form is seen and ever changing at the full development of the inner knowledge the surrounding body is found to be the outcome of his gracious light thus we see only the arpan jodi is completely full in and out of soul atom while the grace of the light is commanding from the innermost of the soul the light itself was undergoing many changes from the material stage thus the divine arpan jodi alone is complete and full in the whole space it is only different in appearance in the is the inner stage of soul is grace and the outer light in fact it is the one gracious light both in and out just like sugar and its sweetness is full everywhere but taste will come to experience only after it is tasted and expressed by a person it does not mean that sweetness of sugar was concealed inside the substance in the same way our arpan jodi is everywhere but the grace of it comes to experience after so many years of external changes and the divine arutparan jodi is ever and everywhere complete it is never divided by anything it is indivisible it is said tirivuttu ariya perum porul one supreme entity which is eternally existing in the whole space of the universe this one arutparan jodi filled everywhere is always complete never to be broken or changed to form some other things when we see the multiverseous universe around us we think all are other than arutpan jodi which has changed itself into all these various objects filling the world the fact is otherwise arutpan jodi is not changed into anything it is only arutpan jodi for ever but the arutpan jodi cannot be seen anywhere outside it is working from the innermost only to manifest out at grace stage the outer state of the sarpan jodi is appearing into five forces which are the basic cause of all different appearances of the universe therefore all shows of external appearances are nothing but arpan jodi alone meant only for producing the practical experiences in the end thus we can acknowledge that one arpan jodi itself without undergoing complete transformation appear into all things in the personal experience arpan jodi is realized from soul temple this soul is but an atom of whole arpan jodi this atom is not actually divided by anything just like a drop of water imagined in the deep oceans our particular soul atom in the boundless space of the universe is supposed we know the very same sea water alone is existing as a drop in and out of it is but the same to this particular soul atom full of grace as enable its light to form into different kind of appearances and finally in the human forms of gracious form of gracious knowledge where arpan jodi has its realization therefore this indivisible arpan jodi is ever in complete form at any point of this completeness arpan jodi may reveal 
the inner experience when the surrounding light becomes the knowledge of grace arat paranjodi is self effulgence and graceful and the grace itself is even working for its self expression in the atomic stage the core of grace was only atomic nuclear and electronic forces which developed into gravitational and electronic forces in material bodies in the biological lives the divine grace appears as the life energy and sensuous feeling in the human life the grace has developed into mental and reasoning power and soul knowledge arat paranjodi is to be experienced as the inner grace knowledge within the soul knowledge arat paranjodi arat paranjodi tani perum karunai arat paranjodi daiva